Hi. Yes. Hello. Welcome back. Lake Hartwell Brown Road Boat Ramp. I'm out here trying some lures today and seeing what happens. The top water was really cold this morning. Like nothing happened at all. I couldn't get anything about it. So it's going to be a hot one today, guys. Mid 90s again. Man, I'm ready for fall. I think we probably got another five to six weeks of this hot to scorching weather. And then it's probably going to start cooling down. Once we get to where we're staying in the 70s for highs, this bite should pick up. On your screen right now, you should be seeing the launch point for the day, the path I'm taking. You're going to see the temperature of the water, the temperature of the day, the real fill, the start time, and the end. So I'm going to hit some natural structure going around to these docks over here. And then I'm going to spend the day hitting the docks. Yeah, guys. Guys, let's uh let's go do this let's have some fun let's see if we can catch anything on spinners you know the H&H &H mini spinners that I like so much we'll see if we can catch anything on a Texas rigged weightless uh, yum dinger and then I think I've got my chatter jig with a fat Albert June bug from zoom let's see what we can find There's one. There's a bass. All right. Aha! On the board. The imaginary board. <laughs> we'll take it. Whoa, what a sound you made. All right. All right. You work it out, buddy. All right, there he is. I'm gonna guess this back camera's probably dead. I haven't changed the battery in a bit. But uh, let's see what we're at. Mouth closed, bro. Alright guys, we got 12 and 3 quarter, maybe, do you count the back fin going over? So I'm going to go 12 and 3 quarter, I think that sounds fair. Alright little buddy. Later. On the board, the H&H &H mini spinner. I'm telling you guys, if there's a spinner I like, it's this one. These are like 99 cents guys. And if you've been watching my channel for a while, you've seen me fish with these. They're disposable. You snag them, you don't get your feelings hurt. It's not a $7 booyah spinner bait. It's just simple. It's, and this one's the 1 16th an ounce, no, 3 16th an ounce one. Double Colorado blades, silver. Black and white is my go to color. I like the yellow and black a lot too, but that's my go to. This is just a fish catcher, all there is to it. Jeez, man. Uh, uh, uh. Right through his eye. There you go. Get up that way. Right, there he goes. There he goes. Over there. Come on. Come on. Got him. Y'all probably didn't get a good angle on that one. It's too busy trying to fight waves to get over there. All right. Huh. Finally, a second one on the day. He's definitely smaller than the first. But let's see. First one was what, 12 and three quarters? Definitely smaller. 
All right, close the razor sharp teeth, bro. Shut it down. Now this one's 11 and a half. He's not much smaller. He just seems a lot smaller, but yeah. Come here, buddy. Let's free you. Have a good one. We did make a change. We moved from the 2.5 inch big bite minnow curl tails to these Gopa Live three inch minnows. Just a little bit different profile. Now he pretty much ripped it apart. I'm gonna try and get another hit out of it. The hook is still the Akashira 1 8th. So I was using the 1 16th. I went slightly bigger so I could get a little bit further, a little bit deeper. Uh, paid off that time. Second bass of the day. Don't be a cat, don't be a cat. Be a big bass, be a big bass for me. You're a cat, you're a bass. Oh, 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 oh yeah, woo! <sighs> Biggest one of the day, easily. What's up? Sharp teeth. Not a monster, but definitely the biggest of the day, I think. We're gonna measure them and find out. All right, here you go down. Mouth closed. Oh yeah. There we are, 14 and three quarter. That's, yeah. Here's your cord one. All right, buddy. Ah, no, you didn't do that. Stop, stop, stop. Let me help you. Let me help you. All right, buddy, thank you. Hello, all you beautiful, wonderful YouTube people. So it's the end of the day. It's a hot one today. Three bass, one bluegill. Um, I'm a couple minutes away from the boat ramp. As soon as I'm finished with this little outro, we'll be over there. I'll be back out again in two days. I don't know where I'm going to go. I need to hit up some other spots. I'm getting kind of tired of Brown Road boat ramp this year, if I'm being honest. Um, it's just bloody hot. And when I go over here and I want to get to the docks, as you saw at the beginning of the video, it's, it's a little bit of a trek to get over there. So, but yeah, uh, weight accumulation. I'll take that. Three bass on the day. Um, that's good for me. Bad for some of you professionals on here. For me, that's fantastic. That, that's that's a good day. What more can you say? Thanks for coming along. I'm going to head out now. Bye. Nah. Adios.